Hey everybody, um, I'm going to apologize in advance if I'm not overly enthused. I am just really tired, I woke up at 8 o'clock, 8.30, um, and I've just been going all day, and I'm tired, and my rook piercing, which I, I talked about on Twitter, right there, literally feels like somebody stuck a hot knife through my ear and left it there. It's been like pulsing all day and all yesterday and like it woke me up last night because it felt like I um it felt like somebody had shot fire like a arrow of fire into my ear and I've never had a piercing hurt this bad and so I'm like I paid forty dollars to want to die and then the uh, tragus piercing every time I smile or talk it hurts so I feel like I have braces again because I can't I don't want to talk or make any movement, you know, and then my hair looks like shit, um, because I've been leaving it curly, because, um, I've started P90, I, I said so on Twitter, I'm gonna start doing weekly weight loss stuff, I think, um, this isn't a vlog, I don't know why I'm talking about all this, but anyways, because, um, yeah, so I've been leaving it curly, so I don't have to straighten it every day. So it looks kind of poopy, but I really don't care. So we're going to talk last. I was really excited for last night's episode because um, it's about Richard. And I've always been curious about his story because, you know, they never really explain anything. He was very mysterious. You never really knew what was with that guy. Um, but I can't say with complete confidence that I absolutely loved this episode simply because... My, what I like about Lost is the to and from aspect it has. You'll be on the island, and then you'll go to a pa uh, flashback, or you'll go to a flash forward, or you'll go somewhere, but then you come back, and you see what's in real time, because that's what you really care about, you know? It's nice to know the backstory of characters, and it's nice to know what will happen, or what's happening in the sideways um, parallel universe, but I care about here and now and that is on the island with everyone that I love and love to see and this entire episode was backstory and I know it's making up for like four seasons however long Richard's been around um I, I get that maybe four or five seasons I get that it was making up for that but it was just too much I think like I feel like it could have been a lot shorter and I mean all it really did for me at least, was just confirmed what everyone already pretty much knew or suspected. Like, <clears throat> I don't know, I mean, we knew Jacob made him um, immortal, and we knew, we well, we suspected from earlier this uh, season that he came from the Black Rock. We suspected that Flock was being used as a puppet by the Man in Black, and those are the things we learned. I mean, we learned that the um, Black Rock destroyed the statue, I guess. And I don't know. I mean, it was a good episode, but it didn't live up to my standards. I guess because I was expecting it to be an awesome, awesome episode. It was alright. Um, I did like the whole thing with Richard um, and his wife how they did that um, at towards the end when he got the necklace back and Hurley was seeing her or whatever. I thought that was really sweet. It was really cute. <laughs> I was watching with um, my friends and my boyfriend yells out, we get to see rears, <laughs> which is Richard Tears. Because we always, you know, say jeers for um, Jack Tears, Sears, Sir Tears. So he's like, oh, look, rears. And I laughed really hard. Um, anyways... So, yeah, this is a short one. I did like this episode, but just a little bit too much backstory. I thought it was kind of just like, come on, this is the final season. We want the action. And I know that it's just a lot of, it's just, I guess it's just been a lot of build up, which isn't bad, but it's just a lot of build up. Next week is going to be the Sun and Jin episode. Hopefully it's good. Um, yeah. That's all I got to say. I think I'm going to do a vlog later this week, maybe tomorrow or the next day, talking about stuff. Because I know not all of you like Lost, and I feel like I'm just all I do on this channel is Lost talk. Because that's my one commitment thing. Um, so I definitely will do it. So, see you next week!